in my um, Amazon Seller Central, I'm creating my own product. I'm uploading the product. Uh, but when I enter the item name, uh, item type, keyword, and all these details, then finally you have to enter the external product ID, uh, which is my UPC code that I purchased from GS2.org. And I choose this is a UPC. Um, when I choose that, it automatically gives me error messages. The SKU does not match any ASIN and contains invalid values. This seems pretty weird because this is a valid key I purchased, uh, officially registered under my company, uh, but um, I want to fix it. So it's a very simple process. Um, so all I need to do is go to Amazon Central, underneath uh, Amazon seller central.amazon.com help slash center. Underneath, if you look at this, uh, you select the store in US and selling on Amazon. And here, this basically, um, you need to pick uh, the issue like adding a product. This is the category because I'm getting the error message during the time. It could be either one like 5461, 5665845572, or these are different type of error codes. Since I know it, this is uh, my error message, which I'm getting is 8572. So I select this. Then it finally asking me set of troubleshooting common issues. Uh, received an error message or a code, I select that. Then um, it gives me different type of error messages like uh, brand name authorization, brand match only error, all these things, right? But since I say uh, it is a GTIN ISBN related issues, I select that. Then you provide this, uh, the product ID, which is the UPC code that you received, brand name, product title. When you press, when you click on it, you you continue, click on continue, then it will, you know, give you an option to upload the certificate. Once you upload the certificate, then probably within a couple of hours, Amazon Central Central validate the certificate, then they will enable and fix the problem. Boom, that's it. It's a matter of a couple of hours, you fix the problem. Thank you.